filmmaker Tamerlan Gadirov are joining us live in studio today. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thanks for having thank us. You. You're so inspirational. Oh, thank you very much. So how is it dancing? How long have you been doing it now? So it's been about two years now. I retired from Paralympic swimming in 2013 and wheelchair ballroom dancing is something that I really just always wanted to do, but it's not very popular here in North America. So it was very difficult to find a teacher that had experience in teaching wheelchair ballroom dancing. So I happened to see a post from Fred Astaire Bloomfield Hills that they had hired a teacher mm -hmm. and I jumped at the opportunity and quickly fell in love with the sport. That's awesome. And what's it like working with someone so inspirational, Tamerlan? Oh. I like work, work with her. She, she, she has more, a lot of energy. Mm -hmm. I can tell. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> she has a lot of energy and she's always fun, she's always happy. And I like to work with her because we're doing great job with her. Mm -hmm. We stay with her, I don't know, six months or seven. It's a new mm -hmm. partnership. Yeah. Okay. And it, it was really good. good. And we're both competitive, so oh, yeah. We, yeah. That's a good thing. You have, if you're yeah. a Paralympic exactly. champion, exactly. you have to be. <laughs> so how many people are part of the program now, Cheryl? You know, we've cl um, probably now taught close to 100 people to dance. Um, okay. We have our monthly program, free program, um, thanks to the Rehabilitation Institute Michigan Foundation that mm -hmm. um, provided the grant for us. So we're doing our monthly program at Fred Astaire Bloomfield Hills. And um, Tamerlan and I also travel around the state. We've been to Grand Rapids and Traverse City and teaching there. So uh, uh, close to about 100 people. And then this past year, we just started teaching amputees who have prosthetic limb to dance. So um, it's just been incredibly rewarding to be able to share some Thing that I love with other people and just to see the expressions and the smiles on their face when they realize that yes they still can do an activity that they once enjoyed and loved doing before. Yeah you're like inspiring them to keep going after their dreams no matter what right? Yeah. So how do you guys come up with the choreography? Oh. That's his yeah, job. It's okay. <laughs> it's a collaboration. It's <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, it's um, some some people say it's too difficult for for uh, co for uh, coach who doing this. Mm -hmm. You know, it's a little bit difficult. But uh, I always try to make a routine for it looks like standing partner, mm -hmm. and after mm -hmm. I just put on her, okay. and some some Adapted. some pieces we just changing with her because, you know, she need feel comfortable, not right. like me. You know. Right. I will dance with her, it's okay, but she need to much feel and more yes. feel good about it okay. yeah but as you saw in the piece we do i mean we really push the limits i mean we do I crazy li we do lifts and spins and yeah so um yeah it's uh it's not for the faint of heart yeah you're kind of the bomb you are <laughs> really are you really are so if people want to get involved how do they find out more about the program they can call fred astaire uh dance studio in bloomfield hills and find out about our upcoming program we have one this saturday at um 11 o'clock and then our next one is November 26th at 11 o'clock. So awesome. yeah, those awesome. are our next two upcoming ones. Thank you guys, yeah. Cheryl Tamerlan. Yep. Thank you for thank being you. here. Thank you. We will be right back everyone. Oh, More gosh. live in the D.